people talk about, well, it's in the cloud. Well, what does that mean? It means it's in a bunch of servers in one of our data centers somewhere. The physicality of the internet and of the world around computing is huge. When we build a data center, we build our own substations. You know, we buy a strip of land through all the adjacent properties to bring in power lines. They're huge consumers of power. The whole idea of Moore's Law, you know, things are getting smaller and faster and cheaper every year. The issue is they use twice the amount of power. A problem that everybody has in this kind of compute world is that you install everything and you consume all of the power and then it immediately starts to age. So we had to start figuring out ways to add power capacity and basically what we were doing was expanding our data centers by a megawatt of power per year. And we saw that we were going to have to do this essentially forever. And so you start looking for ways to change that equation. We can now look at our data centers and say, well, all we need to do is free up a tiny little bit of power, a tiny little bit of capacity. And using that little bit of capacity that I freed up, I can take the same amount of power and put dramatically more computing in that same power footprint. And very recently, we've seen great progress in that. Last year, I said, I'm not going to build any more data centers. Now we're going to close some data centers. And that's right for the environment, it's right for the company. I've got kids, you know, I, I, it's important to me to do the right thing. And so this is a real opportunity to do that.